Hey, everybody, Justin here. Things don't go as planned. This is just a quick, short update video to let you know what's going on and to show you a few cool rocks of the red variety that I picked up today to see if they would take a polish. But we'll talk to that about. We will talk about that here soon. But yeah, I'm in a different environment. The Jaws Jr. family is going through some uh, challenging times right now. So we ask for your thoughts and prayers for my family and prayers for some strength to get through everything. It's been one heck of a time since April of 2022. So with that, we are looking at some rocks that I just went down and picked up because I needed some rock therapy. So I went and walked around a couple spot that I have access to and I picked up a red rock. So I thought, you know, I'm going to stick with the red rock theme for the most part. There's a couple of others in here. It's kind of an orange color and other things. But the idea of this was... To be able to show you something, to let you know that, hey, we don't have an actual big video coming up this weekend. Not yet anyway. We might have one tomorrow. But I wanted to show you that, hey, it does not have to be a particular agate or jasper or common opal or rhyolite or whatever. If it's a cool looking rock, That could take a polish, you think, if you think it could take a polish, pick it up and try it. And you know, if this these fail, which, you know, this one here may not take a polish. Let's get it wet and take a look at it. But look at the color of it. When it's going to get polished, it's going to be, be incredible. Same with, uh, let's just pick on this one here. Let's get that one wet. See, it's kind of bland. You turn her over the other side. Oh my, what's that? So there could be some pretty good potential in here. And this is how I learned on polishing rocks, was on this stuff here. This is what I broke my teeth in on, on figuring out what will take a polish and what won't. And it's been a while since I've done anything like this, where I've just picked up some random sized pieces and sometime this spring I'll throw them in a barrel with other stuff and we'll see if they take a polish. I don't know. So if you take nothing else away from this video today, don't be afraid to take a chance on something that could look cool because you could be surprised. You never know what you're going to find out there. See, look at there. There's some patterns on that one there, if we can stay in focus. And just treat this hobby as relaxing, fun, learn new things. Now, this is a piece of quartzite. And I like the color pattern on it. I just like how that looks, so I picked it up. Granted, it's not part of the red theme, but that's okay. And then here's something else here that's going to look cool. So get out there. Find a place where you know there's some cool looking rocks. And again, it doesn't have to be what the masses are always going after. The nice agate with waterline or banded or the different varieties of jasper that's got pitcher jasper or the green with reds mixed in with it or the brisiated jasper. You get something that looks cool to you, take it home, throw it in a tumbler, and see what happens. And if it doesn't polish, throw it out in the rock garden. If it does polish, fantastic, you've learned something. And give them to kids. A kid would be so happy to have a rock that can fit in their hand that's nice and shiny and smooth. 
They'd be so happy to have something like that. Throw it into a bucket or a container and let them pick through it and figure out what they want. You'd be surprised at the smile you will get. And that is worth all of this. So we have got to have some challenging times ahead of us here with the Jaws Jr. family. Uh, I'm not going to get into too many details because we don't have answers yet as of the day of filming this. But we will get some answers. We're going to move forward. And hopefully everybody will be in better condition in a short period of time. So I'm going to let you guys go. Just remember, everyone's life's an adventure. And I don't know if this adventure is one that I want to share, but I am. This is Adventures for Jaws Jr. Have a good one, everybody. And thank you so much. I really appreciate it, each and every one of you. See ya!